Hello everyone, welcome to Block Point. Okay, as uh, this is a new channel, please help us subscribe and watch the full video. We're going to be showing you a quick video of all the best places in London to go and visit for free. As you can see, we started off with Holland Park. As you go along, you'll see all the videos that we've done. Hope you enjoy it and watch the full video, please. As you can see, Holland Park has got beautiful waterfall. There are other things in Holland Park you can see, so I would suggest you go and visit. Now we're in Greenwich. All I'm going to show you is the sunset. You can walk up to the hill. It's the best view of London. You can see Kinney Roof and everything. I like the view. You can go and watch it too. Uh, this is Green Park, another beautiful park, which is right next to Beckingham Palace. So if you visit Green Park, you can see Beckingham Palace. Right close to you, you got Piccadilly as well. All walk, walking range. It's a very big park. You can enjoy it. You can spend the whole day there. As you can see, there's a beautiful bird. We took some food with us, feeding the bird on our hand. Huge farm. Very close to London, not that far, about 12 miles. It's a fruit farm. You can go and eat much as you want. On the way back, if you want to bring some with you, then you'll have to pay. Otherwise, you've got all the fruits there, apple, plums, pear, strawberries, and you've got vegetables as well. We went very late in the year, so there wasn't much there. If you go beginning of August, everything's there. Now we've come to Trafalgar Square, which is right next to Beckingham Palace. Again, you can walk it there in a couple of minutes. It's the best, it's the center of London, basically. You can see everything there. There's a drone flying there, so I'm sure someone else is making a YouTube channel or a TikTok video. Usually you'll see a lot of pigeons there the day we went, there weren't much. People weren't feeding them. So we didn't see much pigeons. You got a waterfall. Looks beautiful. Keep on watching, there's other stuff coming through. That waterfall just looks beautiful. We stayed around for a couple of hours. This was during Christmas. Canary Wharf, Docklands. They had some beautiful lights. We drove down that day. It was too lazy to walk. So you can walk and see. Uh, I missed out on Canary Wharf. I didn't show you Canary Wharf. So Canary Wharf is the main point of uh, Docklands. You can go, it's, I think it's the second tallest building in London at the moment, just before Shard. There's a shopping center downstairs as well. So you can shop there as well. This is the best place you can see all of London if you go to Sky Garden. It's a beautiful place inside and the view from the Sky Garden is outstanding. You can see the Shard right across here. Obviously the Shard is taller, but I think you'd have to pay in the Shard to go. But this is Sky Garden. You, if you book it pre-hand, it's free. Look at the view is amazing you can see tower bridge london bridge all the bridges from sky garden i think you can even see Buckingham palace you've got tower of london right next to it this view is just amazing look at this it. you can see the whole of london from there i loved it that was an amazing day out for us Look at it, that's the shard. You can go on top of shard, but it's really expensive. Why pay when you can do it for free? That boat is, I don't know how long it's been there, but it's been there for a long time. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button.